you're looking to upgrade your concealed carry revolver, the Taurus Executive Model 856 might be for you. But before we take a look at this great custom revolver, I want to tell you we got a gun giveaway going on. It's happening right now. It ends really soon. All you got to do is click in the link down below to learn which brand new gun you could win. Taurus Executive Model 856. This is a 38 special three inch barrel with the full under lug to put a little weight out forward. It is designed for concealed carry, but upscale concealed carry. Fit and finish is amazing. It's got the square butt, custom laminated walnut grips and a bobbed hammer to make sure that it doesn't snag when you're carrying it. And it also forces you to fire that gun in double action only. Six rounds of 38 Special and a super smooth action. This is gonna be a fun gun to shoot and a great gun to carry. It also has fixed combat sights, channel on the top, and a beautiful black ramp out front. Very easy to pick up. It's the Taurus Executive Model 856. It's a true fighting 38 Special concealed carry revolver. We're gonna put 500 rounds down range and see how this gun shoots. I already love how it feels. Time for the shootability and reliability test. I got a pile of Sig Sauer 38 Special ammo. I think we brought out 500 rounds. I am just gonna hammer rounds through this thing, put it down range, put it on steel, blow up some soda cans, have a good time while we're testing the shootability and reliability of the Executive Model 856. Here we go. Should have brought speed loaders for this, but it's just brand new right out of the box. I actually had to rip the tag off in order to uh, get this thing ready to shoot. Coming right out of the box, no cleaning, no oiling, nothing. Here we go. Wow, I missed one shot out of six on the mammoth target. Let's just keep loading and firing and loading and firing. It shoots really smooth. I love the big square butt grips on this thing. Some people might say they're a little bit difficult to conceal. I don't believe it. I know, I know that uh, Galco is currently making a holster called the Combat Master that is designed for this 856 three inch gun. This is just super smooth and nice to shoot. The grips absorb the recoil. The lug under the front gives you a little bit of extra weight out front. I'm uh, if I am missing, I'm missing a little bit high, I think. Let me look at the sights carefully. Ooh, thought we had seven. Fired one on the empty chamber. We're just going to keep going with this thing and pound it down range. Let me see if I can shoot a couple of these soda cans and make some things explode. I guess I've shot, shot the steel mammoth enough times. Take careful aim and... I missed. Wow, that explosion cleared off the shelf. Now we're starting to hit. Need a good full sight picture I'm finding with this sight. So make sure that you have a six o'clock hold and everything is level or you will be shooting a little bit high, but talk about comfortable to shoot. I'm a big fan of 38 Specials. I own a Model 10. And let's eye this up. With a long trigger pull, but right on target. I think we have some more rounds in here. Well, I lost count. That should be six, yes. Get these babies out and just keep going. I'm seeing no problems whatsoever. Like I said, I started this gun right out of the box. No cleaning, no lubrication, nothing else. The action is super smooth and very well tuned. The lockup is nice and tight. I'm gonna shoot fast again at the steel. There we go, missed the first shot because I never claimed to be the world's best shooter. The action's getting a little bit hot as we <laughs> go to town with this gun, but uh, not unbearable. We're just gonna keep on shooting it and punish the gun and make sure that it works. Oh, I thought I had six in a row. 
Couldn't do it on camera, but this is shooting nicely. Just reload and shoot and reload and shoot and build up a pile of brass because that's what makes us happy. Happiness is a pile of warm brass. Here we go again. Six for six, now I'm getting on target. Took me a little bit to understand how this gun works and feels. I'm really liking it. The three inch barrel is what I think to be the perfect barrel for a concealed carry revolver. The under lug here gives you a little bit of extra weight and helps you stay on target for second shot. Follow up, smooth trigger press. Oh, I missed it. Saw me flinch that time. Every once in a while, even experienced shooters will flinch. That's why we have to do our dry fire practice. And I am just pushing through the ammo to the best of our ability. Let's see what we got for soda cans downrange. There, that one's gone. That one's gone. That one's gone. Oh, I missed the soda bottle. Oh, I love it when they fly around like that. Okay, let's set this down. Talk a little bit about the spent brass. I'm looking at great primer strikes. I mean, I told you that this action was tuned and smooth. This thing is hitting the primer firmly. Um, we're using Sig Sauer ammo. Uh, there's some really high quality ammo there with Sig Sauer anyway, so I don't have to worry about you know, uh, hard primers or anything of that nature, but this gun just shoots and shoots smoothly. It is a six round revolver. That might be the only knock on it as a concealed carry gun is that you only got the six. The, the action is nice and clean and, and the string springs are firm and, and the ejection is, is direct. It's working really good. Again, a six shot revolver, if that's what you want for concealed carry, it's gonna work for you. It's an 856, so there are speed loaders out there for it, but it does limit you to six rounds. But it's accurate, it's reliable, it looks and feels good. It's a shooter, it's a concealed carry pistol. Let's load it up and see if I can hit something from a crazy distance. And when I say crazy distance with a concealed carry shot, I'm looking at, you know, 75 feet or so because anything further than that, you probably really don't have an imminent deadly threat, but you might have to make a long shot. So let's just see how far back I can go and blast that orange crush bottle off the rail. Notice the entire camera crew is moving out of the way. So I'm back a measured 100 feet right here. Now we're gonna see at double action can I find the sights with my old eyes and keep it on target? There we go, took me a little bit. But yeah, it shoots nicely even out to distance. And again, I flinched. I'm anticipating a little bit of recoil, but this is a nice shooting 38 Special Revolver. This is getting pretty hot up front. We've gone through a lot of rounds, folks. And uh, I declare this a shootable and reliable 38 Special Combat Style Revolver Plus. It has the smooth action, the bobbed hammer, the double action only. This Taurus Executive Model 856 is an excellent pistol. Not only is it great for concealed carry, it just looks and feels good too. Want to know the three biggest mistakes when carrying a handgun? Then click on the video next to me to reveal all three mistakes. Mistake number two may shock you. Everybody has their own cardinal rules for what they're gonna do when they're carrying a gun, but right now I'm gonna give you three things that you must never do